Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go and show you how to send pictures from your phone over to your PlayStation 5. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So sending pictures from your phone over to your PlayStation 5 is very easy. Now I am using the PlayStation app on my phone to go ahead and get the pictures. Now let's quickly go over to my phone app. I'll show you how to do this. So here is the PlayStation app. You can easily get this from the Google Play Store or the Apple Store and just select this. Then type in at the top PlayStation app, just like that. And then open this up, install it, sign in with your email address and password associated with your PlayStation account. Now you'll be on the home screen right here. Now what we want to do is go down from the top, just go ahead and hold this and scroll on down. Now you can send your pictures to my account called search-browser just like this and then you don't have to come up with a specific account to send them to like a second account or like send them to a friend. So just go to search-browser, search for this user profile and send your picture to it. Then in the messages, Go to this little image icon, select that. Now choose your image. So I have a bunch of pictures on here. So here's some Dr. Disrespect and Doom Guy. So let's select a few of these pictures and then send them as a message. So we have three pictures on my message thread right here. So let's go to send and boom. This is being sent now to search dash browser on my PlayStation 5. So all these images we can get on our PlayStation 5 right now. So I sent those over. So let's go back over to my PlayStation now. So let's go to my game base right here by pressing the PlayStation button, then going over to parties. And this will be called messages in the future. So let's go to search dash browser now. This is a favorite account. So it's displaying at the top for me. And to add them as a favorite, all you have to do is go to more and then go to add as favorite and they will always show up, up at the top. And I'll use this account to like send specific like links to like google.com so I can search the web browser on the PlayStation or just send images to. So here is Doom Guy right here. Here's Dr. Disrespect. Now to get them actually on your PlayStation permanently, select the image, go to view image, then Press the share button on your PlayStation 5. And this will take a screenshot. So now that I took a picture of this, I can go to my next image. So here's Dr. Disrespect looking great as always. Now press the share button and it'll take a picture and you'll see an indication in the upper right that you took a picture. Let's go to my last image here. Take a picture. And boom, we have all those images on my PlayStation 5 now. Now hold down the share button and open up the media gallery. So let's go over to the image on the far left and then go to media gallery right here. And we can see all these images now on my PlayStation 5. So they're actually on the hard drive. Now with these images, I can open these up in Share Factory now or send them as a message to someone else. So let's select Dr. Disrespect right here and go to edit. And then we can add text, crop, etc. under here. Otherwise, we can go to edit in Share Factory Studios where we have a lot more different options under here as well. Or we can add them to a specific video if we want. So under here, we can do things like uh, pan and zoom, add a filter. So let's add a filter quick. Let's go to colorize just like that. Ooh, that actually looks pretty good. And then I can save it and export it back to my media gallery. Or you can add this to like one of your video timelines if you are wanting to do that. So let's go to the video editor and go to my last project. And all you have to do is press X under here and then go to add screenshot. Once you have this on your PlayStation 5, the most recent screenshots should show up right at the top. Just select it and then you can add it to your timeline. Boom. And then if you're making a video and you wanna talk over like a screenshot, it's very easy to do that. Now this works the other way also. So if you wanna go ahead and send a screenshot to your phone, just go to screenshots under the messages 
and then find an image you want to export to your phone and go to send. And once it's in here, you can get it on your phone and then download it to your phone. So let's go over to my phone. So here are the images. Let's go to my image. I just went ahead and created it on ShareFactory and go to the download button on the bottom right. And we'll get this on our phone. It's saved to my PlayStation app under my phone's gallery. So this is very easy to do. So if you want to go ahead and send and receive pictures from your phone to your PlayStation 5, go ahead and get the PlayStation application. And if this video did indeed help you out, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech out videos coming up next on your six studios. And go ahead and send your web links and your images to this account I created specifically for this called search-browser.